Eight. We're not there yet. There. Just had to turn up the volume. And I think we're streaming. Everything's good. This is on the screen. Welcome. Welcome. To Friday edition of Zero Page Homebrew, where we take a look at some homebrew games. And I'm James. I am Darcy. And usually on the Friday show, we look at games we haven't looked at before. And we also have a midweek show, usually on the Wednesday, where we go back and do challenges or complete the game to 100% or try and get a high score or something. Um, but today, it's all new games. And the games today are... I don't know how to pronounce this. AVCS Tech or Asvs Tech? Avs Tech. Avs Tech. Avs Tech Challenge. Yes. Uh, the first part is the challenge. Yes. <laughs> and then it just says challenge. So yeah. you understand that you were. It is a challenge. You were doing you just a challenge. did the challenge. Yeah. Success. The pronunciation. Or failure. Yay. We don't know. We don't know what success is. Uh, the second game is Princess Rescue. And the third game is Super 3D Portal 6. Um, these are all ports of games. These uh, are not new games. Um, they're actually... One is a newish compared to the other ones, the, the original game. Uh, the first one I played uh, on a Commodore 64. I don't know if you ever played it. This That's one. a challenge? Yes. Hmm. Um, the second one is, of course, uh, a port of... Super Mario Brothers. Super Mario Brothers. The plumber game. <laughs> the plumber game, Where you do yes. all of the plumbing. All the plumbing tightening bolts. I think it's mostly running from the things that are in pipes. Yeah, and going, and going down pipes. Yeah. Usually plumbers don't go down pipes. Unless you're like one of those guys that goes into the sewer and cleans out those big clogs mm. of... The, the Fatberg. The Fatberg. That's <laughs> what I was trying to remember. <laughs> Ew, Fatberg. Yes, gross. Uh, welcome to everybody in... The Twitch chat, um, if you're on Twitch watching this, you can come in the chat and say hi to everyone there and comment about our poor playing. Well, my poor playing. <laughs> our increasingly getting better playing. And Dana VC is in there saying, love the music. Hi. Welcome. Um, so, there's this one. Like I said, I played it on the Commodore 64, so I do have some experience with it. Um, but there's some contests going on right now. Coincidentally, I did not know about them when I picked this game to play today. So it's kind of nice that we'll be able to kind of participate in the contest. What is the contest? They're high score contests. Ah, I'm definitely <laughs> not going to win that, but that's all right. Well, yeah, well, one, I've is, accepted. one is just trying to get a score. One is on the Atari Age forums. Um, that one is the called the Harmony Games. And I believe they're all homebrew games ah. trying to get high scores. And this one is, and I think they go on for a month or so. Um, but that's this month's game. And it goes till June something. Hmm. So we're going to try and get some scores on there. Some people on there that already have some scores. Um... Let me see what scores they have. And I believe the do rules. I <laughs> don't want to know. <laughs> do we want to know? Uh, yeah, we could try. Uh, I want to know. I definitely want to know. There's one uh, 1950. Oh, I definitely am crushing that. <laughs> 3510. 3510. And I did announce we are going to play it in the forum there. Uh, 2490. So, so far it's 3510 is the highest. That's it. So 3510. Nothing. I got that in that other game we played. No problem. <laughs> Easy. First couple seconds. Couple, shoot a couple thousand pointers yep. and you're on your pow, way. Pow, pow, pow. Um, zippity doo dow. So I'll let you... Like, you actually have to know how to play this game a little bit. You can't just go on blind. I can't? You can't. Challenge accepted. <laughs> Aztec challenge accepted. I will go on blind. <laughs> uh, oh, and you did it. You know how to play the game already. <laughs> yeah, there isn't much to it. Um, oh, no, I lost a life. Uh, well, I've got 20 points. I just need another 1,000. 3,000. Uh, yeah, this, this part of the game is jumping and ducking. That's all there is to it. Um... If you duck too long, you will die. 
So don't duck That's too That's how long. I you died before. I jumped oh, too soon. Ju oh, jumping too soon. Yeah. You can't jump too soon. Can't jump too late. Can't duck too long. And nobody can see us playing. But I was doing so well. There we go. Oh, I cleared <laughs> level one! Just in time. 300 points. I just need uh, they can 10 times time. that. Yeah. So you get 100 points for... Oh, oh this oh. is a... Oh, God! <laughs> oh, God! Oh, gosh. Yeah, don't get hit by rocks. It's a fairly straightforward game. You said I needed to know what I was doing. <laughs> and I'm totally just like... Just kicking ass. I'm, I'm not just, even telling you how to I don't even know, it. like, how to die. That's that's the thing. You didn't tell me how to die, and I did anyways, because I'm <laughs> very skilled. <laughs> skilled at dying. Oh, I cleared this. Oh, God. The arrows are shorter. Oh, the setting is on easy for Harmony games. Okay. Easy, easy, easy. Uh, I thought there was, you could play anything. Let me just read. Oh, with the easy difficulty setting on A, which it is. Yes, it is. Okay, it already is. We're on the easy. I thought, okay. Will you be using the gauntlet mode setting? Difficulty, easy difficulty setting on A. So I believe this is it where you play both the levels. Yeah, because there's two settings for this game. One is where you only play the arrows. You don't play this this section of the game with the rocks. Um, but for the Harmony games, it is both. Um, so the general... Oh, actually, I've got the manual here. You still playing your first game? Who do you think you I am? Some sort of cheater? <laughs> Ooh, that was close. That was close. The tiny little arrows now. They're not moving any faster. They're just tinier. No, they're moving faster. That's why they're smaller. Okay. They don't look faster. Maybe they're not. I don't know. So I this, think they are. So this game was made by Simon... Because otherwise they'd be easier, not harder. That's true. Yeah, they'd have to move faster. Ooh, that yeah, was close. <laughs> that was close. This game was made in 2006 by Simon Quernhorst. Quernhorst? Yeah. Kermit's getting closer. Yeah, you're almost there. There you go, level three clear. Oh, Get out of the oh, way of those rocks. Oh, God. This game... Oh, crashed. My head just crashed. 1,430 points. That's, that's, uh, that's your that's top so far. Despite my tough talk earlier, I'm pretty, I'm pretty happy with that. <laughs> I will do worse from now on. Can you show them the manual there, just to cover the manual? Up close. There we go. ABCS Tech hey. Challenge. Hey. Yeah, it's working now, eh? What nice. did you do? I set it from picture mode, where you take photos, into video mode. Ooh. <laughs> where it works a lot better for video. You it can't still get too prefers close. faces, though. It does. It does look for faces. So you have to cover our faces. So let's go. Let's try it again. Let's see what I can do. I do have a... Oh, it is much faster. Than this yeah. Ones. These are super slow. Yeah. Which actually... A little harder. Per, is harder <laughs> when you're ducking because you have to duck for longer. Because it takes further. It takes longer to get past you. If you duck too long, you fall down. Oh, I didn't know you fall down for ducking too long. I, I know that... I, with jumping, you fall... You die because you fall onto the blade if you do it. Too yes. So it is also hard for, harder for jumping, too, because it takes longer to get past you. So it's kind of a trade-off with the slowness. <laughs> And I have a little bit of an advantage because I used to play this 30 years ago. I don't know if that's an advantage. <laughs> it's actually really hard to see. Yeah, it's the, the middle rocks. row of the rocks is, is quite so tricky. And because there's bright lights in our eyes as well. <laughs> I, I, I didn't want to say. Yeah. <laughs> there's very bright lights in our eyes. Because we so want to look rocks for falling you. on you, or is he like running? He's running upstairs. It's not oh. really visible. He's in going this game. so fast. He's running so fast. And they're coming down. Because oh, you're trying to get okay. to the top of the pyramid. Um, to probably kill the people that are throwing rocks at you. Because it's pretty annoying. I see. So <laughs> I thought that each time you were getting closer to the pyramid, but you will get all the way to the pyramid. I get it. You get to the pyramid steps. Mm -hmm. And then you when have to run running. up them, yeah. Yeah. Can you read out the instructions? Or the 
Not the instruction. Okay. But we already know how to play. The story. Yes. 1475. Tenochtitlan is ruled by the Aztec sovereign Axe... Axia Cattle, <laughs> son of Motetchuzoma. Oh my goodness, these words, these names. Even as he was being defeated by the Tarascans, Axia... Axia Cattle was expanding his realm by conquering the Mixtecs and Zapotecs. Oh my god, that was terrible! You, being a warrior of the Zapotecs, managed to escape the battlefield together with your brothers, but unfortunately your party was trapped afterwards. Axayactyl offers you the only chance to survive by reaching the coast and leaving the country by boat. He Hell. challenges you with spear-throwing warriors along your path and stone-rolling priests on the pyramids. Breaching the pyramid safe inside allows your team to relax for a short time and prepare for the next trial. So I guess there's just like like a line of pyramids leading to the coast. And you have to run between <laughs> the pyramids. Up and over them. Up and, and over them because you're climbing them. Well, you climb them when you're inside to get to, you're safe for a bit. Oh, okay. Get to rest for the night. Yeah. Okay. General controls. Set up the system as described in the console's manual and plug a joystick into the left control port. Okay. Controller port. I remember in the Commodore like 64, that. you almost, like every game, usually it was in port two for whatever reason. Mm -hmm. But sometimes it was in port one and it was really annoying. I remember I that. Had one joystick. I remember that being really annoying. I remember you going, oh. No, pulling it out and plugging it in. Okay, then I remember the the the, the futzing about like, and there's the no irritation. standardization. <laughs> Atari Twenty Six Hundred Port One is always the default, as yeah. it should be. Why would anybody? Why would the Commodore Sixty Four default to Port Two? You know your rage. Your rage. I bet there's a reason. There probably is. I bet there's a Some reason. Some technical reason. Yeah. But. It works but in, in port one. not knowing it, your rage is validated. Don't ever find out, or you'll have to stop being angry about it. Yes, <laughs> <laughs> that's for sure. <laughs> push the fire button to continue. Push the fire button button. Button button? Really? Push the fire button button to start the game <laughs> and to continue Oops. gameplay after you finish a level or lose a life. Button buttons. It's a fire button button. <laughs> it's a fire button button. Fire button button. Yes, it's the it's the fire button is the label of the button. Ah, uh, but it's a button as well. <laughs> I agree with you that the second button could be left out, but I'm I'm suggesting that perhaps it's not strictly speaking incorrect. Yes. Even That's though it true. might be. <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking like about. Like the ATM machine? Oh, oh my god, it's look terrible. at that! Look at that! Look. <laughs> they caught you in mid death. <laughs> In the uh, in the C sixty four game, he actually like falls off the screen. Oh. That they could have done here. Uh, I played a VCS Tech. Uh, it's a game for the Harmony games, setting on easy for Harmony games. Yes, that is correct. Yeah, are we on easy? We are on easy. Okay. So that we get both. Uh, twenty three twenty. So how did I do? What was the score that we're trying to? You beat one Oops. of the scores, but not the and highest all, score. And this. you were close to you were you were in third of the four scores, not including mine. Third, which is to say that there's two higher than yours. One was twenty-four something here. Oh, something. Damn it. as I recall. Yes, that is twenty-four correct. ninety. Twenty-four ninety. So we haven't even we haven't got second place. But it's only my first game. Yeah, I and think your you're game. right. We should quit. <laughs> quit while we're ahead. <laughs> Yes. Quit before we've tried too hard and still failed. Uh, where do we go? Button, button. Fire button, go. button. That is funny. Push the joystick up to jump and down to duck. Avoid getting hit by spears. Ducking for too long will cause you to stumble and lose a life. So that's the reasoning behind. Yeah. Like your. It gives you the. It gives you the equivalent of uh, not being able to jump for too long. Yes. You're like, oh, stumble. After you reach the pyramid, the game will continue, depending on the left setting of the left difficulty switch. The game continues either with the next gauntlet stage or the stair levels between. Stair controls. Push the joystick left and right to avoid getting hit by the following falling stones. Ooh, I Jesus. died twice. Ah! On, on the stones. Rock on the head. On the stones part, because what, if you accidentally press down. While you're pressing left or right, he 
he stops moving. Oh god! Uh, right in the head. So I told you I would Rock do worse. To I, hey, did I promise you I'd do worse? I did, and, and I'm coming through much worse. <laughs> much worse. <laughs> much worse. That's game over, friends. For you, I was. The game is over. Uh, there. I was complaining that if you press down and to the left or right, you stop moving. So you have to be precise. It like takes into account pressing down, which Ugh, is terrible. When you when the priests are out of stones, you reach the inside of the pyramid and are safe for a short period. Okay. Console switches. Left difficulty. Left easy on A, hard on B. Okay, so we're on easy. Yeah. Uh, a is gauntlet and B is gauntlet and stairs. So we're on hard. Oh uh, no, we're not. What? Left difficulty. Easy is gauntlet and B is gauntlet and stairs. Right difficulty, A is music, easy, and hard is sound effects. We're supposed to be on easy mode. We're not. We are on hard mode. A is hard mode? A is easy mode. Well, we're on A. Okay, but it says A is gauntlet only and that B is gauntlet and stairs. That's all I can tell you. We're on A. Did you switch um, it off and then up? Remember that? You I didn't touch it. it was, yeah, I know. No, I cleaned it all out. I know, but maybe you didn't clean it well enough. Maybe. <laughs> that I'm just saying that according to this, we shouldn't be okay. having rocks fall on our heads. <laughs> okay. That's um, all I can tell you. So the competition is for easy. And the, the definition in the manual for easy is only the first level, right? That's what so I'm saying. So we are incorrect. We are very... We're hardcore, we're playing, that's all I can say. We're playing the hard version then. So... Can somebody comment? Dan ABC, uh, does that um, does that mean we should only be doing the gauntlet? Yeah, please let us know. If you happen to still be there, because Dan <laughs> Dan's the guy who was running the the game competition, so he should know. He would know. Yeah. Uh, do do do. Uh, so reset is to return to the introduction screen, and select is not used. Okay. Uh, and the color black and white, also not used. Okay, good. Scoring points. You score 10 points for every dodge spear or wave of stones. At the end of each level, you receive 100 bonus points for every team member alive. So... Oh, if you, not, just, if you die, just quit and start over. Because there's no point. No, that's you're not, not really getting Because you're not getting the big points. But, like, but you have harder. to go further. It's still worth it to get practice, I guess. I guess. But they won't end up as quick. Yeah. That's all we're the saying. scores is going to be slow. You're going to have to be play a lot better. Playing tips. You receive a bonus life at 5,000 points. So play good and don't die, and you'll be able to not die for longer. <laughs> and get more points. <laughs> That's right. Try to learn the rhythm of the spears and stones in each level and move according to it. It is possible, but very difficult, to stand exactly between the falling stones. No thanks. Use only as a last chance option. No if thanks. you lose a life and have... Another life remaining, the last spear will be repeated, so you will know where it appears. A oh, small consolation, I guess. <laughs> like, if it's up top, and you die from the up top, it's going to be the exact same spear. That's what so it says. Yeah. That's not great. It's helpful, I guess, but, I mean... This is the face he makes when he doesn't think that should have been included in the instructions. No, so it should have. So just take but... it out of the instructions, you have <laughs> angered James. It's like almost an Easter egg. <laughs> It bar it's barely helpful. Because if you lose a life... You can tell he's upset, but he's still <laughs> going on about it. <laughs> still talking about it. <laughs> 20... No, we don't have to be 24. That's like second place. 30-something? 3,000-something. Yeah. Okay. But we're not even in the right mode, possibly. Yeah. And it's <laughs> you're invalidated if you try harder than you're supposed to. Um, but this is also competition. Yes, the gauntlet... Brian picked the game, so I don't know exactly. Oh. Okay. But he said, yeah, you're, we're just supposed to be in the gauntlet. Oh, okay. We'll change it to that after. Then. Yeah. So I'm at 2330 with all my lives. Mm -hmm. Let's see. You can change the difficulty switches at any time, so decide yourself whenever you want to play a stairs level between the gauntlet levels or not. So you could just switch it now and just oh, really? go away. Well, that's just before you dive, dive out and hit and the button and it'll go away. 
<laughs> it says at any time. In the middle of it playing It says the at any time. And <laughs> you go back to the arrows. It doesn't say the switches will do something anytime you flick them, but it does say that you can <laughs> you can change anytime. them whenever you want. Anytime. You can turn off the game anytime you like. You can switch oh. all the switches. It says, and maybe you will discover a hidden AVCS tech secret. In general? Like It just says maybe you will discover it. That's the only clue you get. There might not even be one. You may find it. <laughs> Wait, no. If it says you may, that implies that you might. I think that implies there has to be a secret, but I'm not sure. Ah, oh, I didn't uh, duck long enough. You were afraid there of we go. falling it came on from your the face. Same. That helped me so much. I knew it was coming from the top. It did help you. You're very conscious of it. Not ducking long enough. Yeah, I know. What's wrong? It's because the spears are longer now, in addition to being faster. Yes. So they get faster but shorter to compensate, and now they're compensating the reverse way. It's my fingers. Stay jumping. I'm blaming my fingers. Oh my god! You're running to the Atari pyramid. Yeah, very colorful one. Yay! But I didn't get a big bonus because I have zero lives. I get no bonus. No in bonus. Fact, right? Zero bonus. Yeah. Watch out. Oh, they're easier to see this time. When they're do you green. get, uh... I pressed down again! Uh... Pro tip. Don't press down. Don't press down. <laughs> During the rock stage. Credits! Simon uh, Quernhurst. I'm gonna just go with that. My first try. That's... Pretty much, we're going with that. Yeah. Game program and graphics. Label and manual design. Nice. Pretty much everything. Paul Slocum. Game music. Yep. AtariAge.com. Manual and cart production. This game is based upon the first two levels of the C64 game Aztec Challenge and is supported by its author, Paul Norman. May I ask permission? Good job. Yeah, there's more levels. I can't remember what they are now. So I'm going to switch it to... Uh... Yes, the other one. And well, see. Maybe you put it in backwards? <laughs> the cartridge? Probably. No, not the cartridge. I mean the, the switch. <laughs> the switch when you returned it. No. Oh. I hope not. Well, if you did, it would no, be... No, you can't. You can't. You can't put it in backwards. You tried, but failed. No, you can't put it in backwards. It's not possible. The way it... It's just up and down. If you put it in backwards, it would still work exactly the same. How would it work exactly the same? <laughs> because the switch just goes up and down and connects dots at the top or the bottom. And the bottom and the top oh, are I on see, the machine I see. You didn't take the You didn't take it off the machine. No. Yeah, I see. If I took yeah. it off the machine, then yes. Yes, then. Okay, yeah, it's... Uh, it's working now. Okay. It's the opposite. So is the instruction manual wrong? Did they mess up? I'm, I'm confused. No big. This round doesn't end until June 13th. So we have a while. No, we only have Today. a portion of this day. <laughs> yes, a third for me. Of, for a me. third of this day to get into the rankings. Of course, you also have to have a login to the Atari PC, uh, Atari Age forums. You're past the microphone. Oh, well, I'm just playing the game, man. Intense. I don't know what to tell you except that you're distracting me from victory. <laughs> This is, oh my goodness, this is going to be harder, I think. Because I think these levels are still the same without the intervening rock levels. Yeah, but the rock levels is where we all die. Most of the time, yes. So I'm going to say it's it going to be just as hard. I don't know if that's better or worse. I'm not sure. I'm trying to remember Whoa! what... That one almost took my head right off. Woo, that was now close, I was about too. took my ankles out. I'm trying to remember what the other two uh, levels are on this, what they look like. I, I seem to remember one is a horizontal jumping movement where he jumps along rocks or something and they fall down. Or you have to do a pattern, jump across a pattern This would definitely rocks. be hotter. Hotter? Like out in the sun, no pyramid Woo. breaks. Yes, it would be, yeah just continuously running forever. Maybe with the other ones were way too hard to program. You know, you know what? The I could see why oh. <laughs> even though the rocks were killing us, mm -hmm. 
I see, like, I could see you're right that this would get, like, harder. Harder, faster. Like, you're at 1770 and it's... Ah, oh, I lost a life! <laughs> Jump right There's into There's no it. point in even playing anymore. Right into your neck. Pretty much. You're not going to get the scores as, as high anymore. You're doing the best so far that you have done, I think. There's always the rocks. Yeah! <laughs> the rocks mostly killed me before. Ah, I deserve to die there. I deserve that! I deserve that death! That death was too good for me! <laughs> 1860? Is that your best? Yes. No, my other one was... Uh, no, that... I think it was 11 or 14 before. Yeah, I think that's better than I got before. So you have 18. Let's see how I do with just the arrow levels. The music is really well done. You probably can't hear it. I'll probably, I think I'll turn it up. Or people out there can hear it. We can't hear it here. So the volume too low. But it is pretty much an exact copy of the Commodore 64 music. It's really well done mm. on the Atari. Same, same sounds. Um, maybe the Atari had it built in. Uh, these sounds, I think they do, because they're just simple, straightforward sounds. And the graphics of the guy running is almost exactly the same. It's got the shadow as well. The death is not quite as good, and they could have done the death better in here. The death in the C64 is the arrow sticks wherever it hits, mm -hmm. like on the neck or whatever, and he goes down, and the arrow goes down with him off the screen and falls off the screen, which wouldn't. I don't know be... that that's better though. Oh, like falling off the screen. That's that's like, <laughs> is this a PG thirteen or is this that's true. Uh, rated R? We want to see the blood. We want to see the dead body. <laughs> that's right. Well, he does. He does get killed. He just kind of sits there in a slump. Yeah, exactly. He stays on the screen. Which makes We're not sense. hiding from the violence uh, of I the, see. the Aztec nation. I see. <laughs> not not removing it. That's right there for you to see in your face <clears throat> um, but yeah I like that the pyramids are different yes that Small is very thing, nice but it's kind of cool yeah I can't remember if the pyramids are pyramids are different in the I guess this is nighttime or... yeah no rest for the wicked and no. you are oh so very wicked constantly running well hey, like, if you want to live yeah it's <laughs> people at the sides blowing I mean really re realistically what they should do is have them all run and whoever runs fastest gets shot because like you're letting your enemies go away you don't want them to be strong you want the you want the weak to get away so that they're easy to defeat next time uh yes <laughs> that's not how that doesn't that's not how it would happen but that's what you should do if you're going to be like really like evil about it yes. okay everybody run if you get to the <laughs> You get to the sea, you get to escape. Yay! Except not. <laughs> if you get to the sea, we kill you for sure. Because you're too strong. Yeah, and if you, like, collapse in the desert, then uh, we'll, we'll give you a cart ride. <laughs> we'll give you a llama ride to the, to the sea and put you in the boat and give you some food <laughs> so you can go and infect the uh, rest of your people with your Weakness. weak constitution. That's right. <laughs> breed. Go forth and breed. <laughs> <laughs> That's too dark. Hey, you've gotten yes. to the you've gotten to the, <laughs> the, the fertile. You've gotten to the fertile. Um, it's not a crescent, but the fertile portion. Yeah, it of is. It's the, nice. Uh, land. We're out of the desert. Must it's... be the cornfields, the maize fields. Oh yeah, and then various shades of green now. Mm -hmm. Very nice. Because I mean, you started off in a, a pretty arid area. Oh, oh you lost the wrong way. Now That's it's pointless. This is where I lost. I think most of my lives on this level. Yeah, with just... the red, I was intimidated by the color of the darts coming at me. I was like, "Oh, they've already killed people with these darts. These darts are for real." Well, they're very fast. So you have to make your decision immediately, and you can't make the wrong one. Yeah, and there's, there's no not time. much time to make that decision either. And on the other hand, it's a little bit easier in one aspect, which is that as soon as you see it, you can press the button. You don't have to time anything. Yes. You yeah, know that, when you press the button. There's, the downside is the time to press the button is now! No, 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 no! Immediately. <laughs> as soon as possible. Ah! No more talking. Ducking. <laughs> jumping. No talking. 
Oh, uh, you lost a life. Keep going. You can do it. No, I can't. My you scores are going to be oh, terrible. Game no wonder the scores were like, oh, we're beating them. No problem. It's like, no, no. Not no problem. Yeah. Very difficult. Can we go back to the hard level? <laughs> Keep those scores. Nope. Oh, Arena Foot. Uh, hi, James. I chose this game for the fourth round of Harmony Games contest in the AA forums. I won the previous three rounds. A winner gets to choose the next game title. What is your score so far? Well, it was that, because we weren't playing properly. Yeah. We were playing the easy mode, which is not the easy mode. I don't think I'm ever going to get it. This is the hard mode. Yes. It, it's no, it's easy mode. No, it's easy. This one? We're getting higher scores than the other one. Yeah, but the, one. the, um, you're, but, but we didn't sense. get as far. In a, in a sense, we didn't get as True. far as the other one because each level is two levels. True. This one we're getting further. Our points are lower, but yeah. like the game is not about points. It's about how many levels you get past. Yeah. So, so from that perspective. So what you just saw was the highest score. It's 22 something. So I am not beating you yet. Yet, I say. I don't know if I will. Because you have 20 not 2490 is your highest so far. Darcy's is 18? Yeah, 1880. Yeah. But I think I think I can do better than 22. Maybe not much more than yours, and I don't know if I'm gonna be able to beat. Mr. When guy. I jump, my foot twitches because I want to get higher. <laughs> Helps you. <laughs> Lifts me up. A whole body jump. Whoa. Yeah, 35-10. That is, that is really good. Oh! See, you still have time to make a mistake here on this level. A little bit. Like, if you do the opposite and you realize that you've made the wrong choice, it the does... The action times are not good. Not good at all. Can you bring yourself down out of a jump? I think you, you can bring yourself up out you of the You try it on your turn. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, I think you. I think maybe you can because I escaped yeah. quickly from my error. From a jump error? Quickly enough to uh, to recover and not die. Ah! ah! Not that time, though. That time I lost life. Or yes. life lost. Life lost. Life has been lost. And, and all your talk of how it's not helpful... It would be helpful uh, in the fast ones to know which direction it came from last time. For See, one I made arrow. it that time. Yep. Uh, I made the mistake and still survived. But you did a duck, then a jump. Yeah. I want to know if you can do a jump and then pull out of a jump to do a duck. We'll, well see. Again, try it on your turn. <laughs> <laughs> Default is easy. Hard is gauntlet and stairs. That's what the manual says. Um. Ah! But. Ah! Yeah. Easy difficulty, just gauntlet. Okay, so all this makes sense. Yeah, all this makes sense. Stop talking! I've never played the stairs. <laughs> <laughs> never played the stairs version. The stairs? I mean, it's easier to get. Uh, that's what I'm. I can understand hard. Like the why they say this. I can understand well, why. I'm ducking now. I'm Let's ducking. See. I'm ducking to help my ducking. Oh! Oh! Whoa. Last life. Oh, oh! You said last life, and then I got distracted. It's your fault. Yes. Yes. <laughs> this is what I don't agree with. I've been doing with. a lot of yelling you agree today. With that? It's. I had a coffee to defeat Ooh. the nap o'clock because this is nap o'clock. Yeah. Two p.m. Every day. I don't agree with easy and hard. I do, and I already explained it to you. It's easier. It's 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 harder. This is supposedly easy. This is easy, but we're getting lower scores. Yeah, but it's not about scores. I already explained that to you. A game is not determined by how easy it is or hard to get scores. It's how easy or hard it is to get through the levels. And the other one is is harder to get through the levels because once you get through the running across the desert, you still have to go up past the priest to get past the level. Yeah. And yeah. so you have to do okay. twice as much. In here, I got way further this way because I didn't have to do the, the, the rock running part. So I got further. I got okay. to a harder difficulty level. Yeah. That's if the whole point. you're talking levels, yes. If you're talking score, no. Yeah, but it's, 
score is just a way to to compare how you did on that level. Because it's, it's not, it doesn't put level one, two, three. You can tell by the pyramids, yes. Yeah. I'm just saying that in, from that perspective, that's why it's uh, harder to do the other one. Because you have to do both of those levels and then you've cleared a level. I was experimenting. I'm not actually doing it. I'm not playing. <laughs> and I'm going to turn it up a little bit. Okay, I'm just, I'll be back. Okay, while I play my game. There, now I can hear it. And play properly. You can't pull out of a jump. You have to... The jump is very short. I guess pulling out of it would be like not pressing it as long. But the default short jump, if you just press it, is shorter than the jump if you hold it. So you kind of can pull out of it a little bit. But not really. You can't immediately pull out of the jump. So those scores in the competition are legit scores. That's for sure. Those are those are good scores. But I think I could get in the rankings if I practice. I don't know about getting that top one. That is that is hard. Those are high scores. secret is to make sure you keep all your lives all the way through. It's hard to believe that you haven't played the stairs version, but I guess it's not in competition and that's what's that's what you're going for right now. But it does add quite a bit to it. It's too bad they didn't do the full all four levels. I think it was four levels or at least three on the original Commodore 64 version. Well, I'm sure there was other ports of it as well. This is a very, fairly simplistic game, but probably keeping within a 4k limit, they needed to keep it to just these levels. Seems a, you know, fair amount of graphics here and gameplay. Okay, so what you can do when you get to the higher levels then, yes, is you can when you can just automatically duck, and then you only have to look: is it high? Oh. You automatically duck, and then if it's high, then you jump. You still have to time the ducking for when it comes out because you can't duck too long, because you will die. Yeah, but the part of your brain that looks for fur and, and claws and teeth, yes, it's like oh, something's coming, and you go down, and then when you realize that it's high. Yes, you can you change. Jump. You can do that on your game. I'm not. Gonna, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna experiment with that tactic. Hey, if you don't want to win, <laughs> just saying, I, I broke the game. <laughs> you figured it out. Um, no, oh, they are coming fast enough that maybe you can do that tactic. It's only later on that you can do it. Yeah. Right now, there's not enough. You don't need to do it, first of all. Yeah. And there's not enough time to do the turnaround. You'll probably die from ducking. Like, now it's maybe you can do it. Yeah, this is the blood red fast. murder darts. <laughs> These are definitely <laughs> murder darts. Oof. Lots of up ones in a row. This oh. is the one where I was, like, not so worried that I lost a life. Because I'm like, what? I'm not going to get past... If I, get, if I even get to the end of this level, I'm screwed. I'm, I'm happy anyway, so I knew I wasn't getting any more bonuses. Yeah, uh, I've already screwed the game up. I don't have enough lives to no, yeah. lives to get any score anymore. Yeah, but you don't want to like give up because otherwise you sure. give bad muscle memory. Yes, all you remember is playing bad <laughs> and giving up. Ah, uh, oh, I went the opposite way. And look at look at that red dart right in your side. Uh, uh, see, it's you right lying back. on the the uh, the ground. That's right, just sitting there. Murdered. Death. Uh, Do you lie the other way if you get stabbed the other way? Like you stabbed Let's try it and in see. your no. I think it's the same. It's your last leg that you die. Yeah. So it's coming from, from the, the right. Direction. It's the yeah. same look. But the dart color But the dart's changes. in the right spot. And, and the, the dart's in the right spot. 
Oh, low. Yeah. Okay, so it does have that. Yeah. So it does have a difference. Um, okay, it's your turn. <laughs> that was your game? No. Uh, 2490 in Harmony Games. I have 2400 posted on the high score currently. Yeah, I thought the high score scores. Oh, no! <laughs> I'm so just, again, I am going to just go pathetic. again. I thought the highscore.com scores are fairly sad. <laughs> What's that? What's happening? What? This the high scores on highscore.com, like mm -hmm. the website, they're pretty low. Like they they need to be higher. And so I was hoping to get a decent score on this, and then we go play the highscore.com competition. Let me see what the rules are for the high score, whether it's this. Easy or hard? Mode. Okay, high score. Oh, there's there's scores for a novice. You know, I don't want to blow my own horn or anything, but I just slayed level one. <laughs> Without dying? Yeah. 410 points. I'm gonna pay for it now. All that trash talk. Karma's, <laughs> karma's gonna get me. Yeah, the highest score on on novice on setting B, which is this one. <laughs> see that? <laughs> see that? The highscore.com doesn't make any sense. Expert A. And novice B, but in the manual it says easy A, hard B. Can you make Arena Foot? Can you make any sense of the highscore.com information? Because on highscore.com it says there's there's two competitions. This is for console version. Um, novice slash B setting. In the manual, it says easy. Oh. Uh, hard B is the B setting. And then for expert, it says A, but in the manual, it says easy is A. The, the scores are higher for the A setting, which that doesn't make sense because you get higher scores on the B setting. So I think they're ignoring the A and B and are actually playing on the expert and novice. <sighs> Highscore.com. Setup is default. What does setup mean? Because it says rules. Left difficulty switch set to B. Um, for novice. Setup but is... Doesn't make any sense. Setup is A default. A. Setup is, is A default or setup is A default? People. All of you, speak Setup English. Setup is A, which is default. <laughs> That's what this says. Because setup is a default doesn't make any sense. Every game for 26... Oh, every game for 2600 is defaulted to B, easy, A, expert. B, easy. Yeah, okay. A, expert. Oh, okay. So that's like... Or were you just keep talking? <laughs> I, I don't even know what's happening now. <laughs> that was your turn. You did terrible. <laughs> I did do terrible. Are you playing now? Yeah, I'm okay. gonna play. Okay. I'm trying to help you because you're having fun talking to people. B novice, A expert. The manual. The manual says B is hard and easy as A. So is the manual wrong? Because A is the gauntlet, it's just this. Um, Except on this machine, in which case <laughs> B is the gauntlet. So is my machine screwed up? No. Or is it? Maybe my machine screwed up. How would it be screwed up? Because we're on B right now. And it says B 
be his gauntlet and stairs. Uh, yes, no, I mean, how... I, I understand why you think it might be, but how is it screwed up? Was it wrong before? Uh, in other games? We can just test it really of. easy after this, just by picking some other game and... We checking. will be testing. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, we'll check that out. Is, is my machine screwed up? Is this the problem? Please let me know. Because that would make more sense if it's my machine. That's all crazy. Novice B. That still doesn't coincide. Oh, look at page 24 of my book. The gaming manual is misprinted. Okay. So okay. if you switch the easy and hard in this, then that makes sense. Okay. And the A and the B. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Then then the highscores.com makes sense then. Okay. So the manual is misprinted. Hooray! So this is B. No, I lost the life. Oh, this is B, this is just Gauntlet, and this is harder, because you don't get as high of a score. Oh, are you just dying on purpose now? No, you're not. <laughs> you got your copies of your book in the mail today? Is that how slow it took to get to you? People got it like weeks, two weeks ago, I think. I'm still working on my review of your book, um, so it will take a little while, a lot longer, maybe a little bit longer than I hoped, Arena Foot, so please bear with me. It says B novice, A expert, so this is novice. Yes. Not which... expert. You keep discarding what I'm saying. It's not about scores. Since when is difficulty B level novice. about score? It's B about how difficult it is to play the game not how high your score is. Yeah. B novice is like Atari titles. It, it says they didn't change it for this title. Okay. B novice. Yeah. See that's that's wrong. Cause it says hard. Yeah. And it's not gone like. Yeah. yeah. It's flipped. So this is all it's flipped, yeah. Okay. It's all wrong and all confusing all the time. <laughs> but we are playing the correct the correct one for the score. That's right. So this will be the last run of this and then we'll play the other one one and you more have time. to wait until Wednesday before you can go for the top score I guess so <laughs> <laughs> what, I, did I beat the world record 2300 no did I just get 22 did I get 24 no I just got 22 so I didn't even beat it yet and it was uh, 30 so 3000 was the best oh. one of the Atari age ones yeah the website high scores are 2300 is the top uh, but it sounds like arena foot has uh, submitted one that's higher already so it's there's some records in waiting to be verified oh it's getting hot in here toasty i put on the fan in how a second. many levels do you have to do to get to the sea <laughs> i don't think you may ever make it to the sea what i think so they were lying uh, yeah, they, this is just for their amusement. <laughs> this is like they're going in. You're going in a circle from temple to temple. We haven't seen a repeat of a temple, but I know there will be eventually. So there's only so much memory, unless they do color cycling, in which they could be lots of different temples, different colored Atari temples. This I guess that would gray. mean that there was a maximum score that you could have, since the scores <laughs> you get points for not dying. Yeah. You literally get points at an even rate of not dying. Oh, except that you get bonuses for having never died. Yeah, so the score is not even if you kill off all your guys and then continue playing forever. As opposed to having all your guys and playing forever. Yeah. 
And also you get a bonus guy at... I can't remember what it was. 5,000? 5, yeah. Which oh, is not yeah, an I guess easy number. Can, I guess if you can keep them all, then you'd be getting even bigger bonuses after that. Yes. So you're... It's like a score multiplier. Uh, terrible! Now Darcy I will, move. Darcy I will move. not get the high score now. <laughs> Yeah, this will have to be reserved for a Wednesday show, obviously. I think I'll make it next to uh, the next Wednesday. Yeah, the bonus is substantial, isn't it? It's like... It's huge. Losing a guy is 100 points per level, and you only get... Like, you don't get much more. You don't get... Well... It's 10 arrows to equivalent... equivalent yeah, exactly. Equivalent of a, a dead guy. Yeah. That's a lot. <laughs> How many arrows? I don't Probably know. Not I was, more than ten. Not much more. It's got to be more because you get like, a, like your end score is like four or five hundred. So it must it's be like four, twenty or thirty arrows. Four ten was the first level. Yeah. So with that, that means, with bonus, with two that means guys twenty one. I mean twenty one arrows then. Okay. Yeah. So twenty one. So probably just over twenty, around twenty. I don't know if every level is the same. Probably. You'd think it would be the same. This is where it gets super hard. Reaction time is like paramount. Yeah. And there's no room for error. Or very, very little. I almost made an error there. Uh, yeah, Did I beat him? Had, Did I beat him? There were 28 that time. 28? That's 2480. Okay, so it might increase because they're going faster. Yeah. What did uh, I Mr. think it was Man 28. Get? No, 20... 24 22. It was 22. 22 this time. So it might have been the same every time. Okay. Uh, because uh, the last... 2490. Two more arrows and I beat him. And I have two guys left, so... I only have one guy. Because you died once. I have an extra guy. Yeah, I have the guy I'm on and one more oh, guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So two guys. And I'll know which arrow is coming, even if I die in the first arrow. So at least get one more arrow oh, to tie Oh, so him. that is useful information? Now it is. Admit it. Admit <laughs> it was useful. Barely useful information. Absolutely useful. In this case, it's do you beat the other record or not? But this only puts you in second. <laughs> I know, which is sad and pathetic. No, it's not sad and pathetic. Second? No. No, it's not. Sad. No. It's the first. Second is the first loser. That's nonsense. <laughs> That's nonsense. Oh my god. Yay! <laughs> Yay! You must admit. You must admit that that was useful. It was. It was useful. Uh huh. There we go. I somewhat satisfied ending the game, <laughs> being in second place. I just got stars. Well, you might That's not cool. be second place. You're only higher than. The, at this exact the, the previous, moment, I'm in no, no. second place. No, because you don't. You only add it if you get a higher score. So there might have been a bunch of people that got more than uh, 2480. No, 2490. This, let me refresh the page. No, no. But what I'm saying is, yeah. do you add to this any score, or do you just add it if yours is higher than the highest score on there so far? Because that seems to have been a place. Can, Someone put a score, and then some put no. a higher one, and then somebody else put a higher you one. You can add anything. Oh, okay. Add, add anything you want to it. Oh, okay. okay. Um, you could. I have 10. <laughs> uh, correction to difficulty setting is B. <laughs> Dan just added that. No, okay. Yes, you wanted to Yeah, make sure it is... Oh, because you can't edit the top, I guess, anymore? Yes, at some point in the forums, you can't change... You can't edit things. It's really annoying. But anyway. Uh, yay! Second place! At this exact moment, which I don't ca think counts for much. But people, this is like round four. So I've already missed the three rounds. So Arena Foot's in first place in this whole competition. So I've been missing out on it. Okay, we're going to... Uh, what time is it actually? Oh, no. We're going to move on to the next game, I think. Yeah. 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 We're going to move on to the next game. Being in second place is, is fine. Is fine. Um, 
There we go. And I was going to put these on the screen. Where were they? Yeah, see, there is the high score for um, novice, which is not novice. It's just setting B, the one we were playing. It is novice. It is novice. It is novice. It yes. is novice. Yes, if you're trying, if you're this dude trying <laughs> to get to the C, are you going to pick the one where you have to run across the thing and then up the stairs of the pyramid? Or are you going to pick the one where you have to run across the desert and then skip the pyramid and run across yes. more desert? It's yeah. Easier, novice. Suck it. <laughs> so You don't care about high score. Yay, I beat the, the highest high score. <laughs> so maybe I'll submit it, but probably not, because this isn't worthy. I can do way better than this. <clears throat> and then the other setting, the one we were playing to begin with, is 6,110 uh, for first place. That's that's a lot. Yeah. Like, a lot. Yeah. <laughs> but mm, if you think you get the same amount of bonus, and it's about the same ramping up of difficulty, maybe multiply that by two. That's about right. So you'd be at 5,000. So it's not unachievable. It's just that, it's just that this, the rock one seems to me, I could be wrong, but it seems to me to be much harder than this. I find it easier. I, when Even I though did I've been it, dying when I did, I, But I think you died because it's not easier. <laughs> I think you died probably. because it is harder. Yeah. It's like there's more room. In this, all you have to do is press up or down, depending on whether the dart is coming from a bottom, above or below. Yeah. And on it, you have to like go back. There's no... Lots of movement. There's lots of things you have to do. You don't get a hint. You just have to like scoot across it. Like it's just harder. It's just harder. Objectively yeah. harder. It, it is. So the next game we're going to play is Princess Rescue. And there's quite a... Uh, a little bit of a history to this game. Let's just get it up first. Um, so obviously it is, once you look at it, you'll be able to tell what game it is a port of, <laughs> let's say. Um, there we go. Uh, who would that character be? That would be Mario. It's Ario. It's Ario without the M. It's a me, Ario. <laughs> <laughs> so let me get my notes up for this. Uh, so this game was made by uh, Chris Spry, and uh, there were. I'm just trying anything? to hold it, and it just wobbles around in my hand. It's fine. It's all good. It's all it's good. Not a great case. Uh, so there were a hundred boxed copies get made of this game originally and unlimited number of cartridges made at the beginning. Mm -hmm. um, and usually you're, you're fine if you change the name of the game. And you can keep all the characters in there because it's a little bit more difficult to go after somebody for um, the look of the game. And it is quite different um, than Super Mario Brothers. Um, but Nintendo is extremely litigious. Like, they don't want to be out of control of their material whatsoever at all. Um, so they go after everything, small or big, as anything at all. So nothing was really said um, by Al uh, from Atari Age, because you don't really want to talk about this kind of stuff when you get pieces of paper with a cease and desist which which you would guess that that's what they got um and it was so the game was released onto their into their store in august 2013 and then it was pulled from the store in september so like within like it was released late august and early september it was pulled and i think it was only in the store for like a week or so um so they didn't actually sell a hundred box copies mm. of it. Um, and so who knows how many box copies are out there? Only Al knows. I don't know how many. He'll probably never say because he doesn't want to say how many actually got sold and are in the hands and how much money he made from it. Um, but the on eBay, I was able to find the uh, boxed copies that went for sale in February 
it went for 250 US dollars because it's really, really limited and is probably the most expensive homebrew game um, out there right now because of how limited it is. Um, probably the second most expensive one is Boulder Dash because it was really, really limited and, it'll, and it was also pulled. Uh, after it was sold for a while because the game company didn't want it selling anymore for some reason. I have no idea. So there you go. I don't know if anybody in the chat wants to fill out um, any more information that I missed. Let's see. <laughs> Arena Foot says it'll be his first purchase. Ah! Oh, the reason he broke the book was to purchase a Harmony Encore cart. This is a two-button game, if I read correctly, um, when you get a fireball. <laughs> um, yeah, I missed out on one of the cards of Princess Rescue, but they got the ROM and the Harmony. Yeah, so this is... I don't have the actual box, or I'd be proudly displaying it, because I wasn't really a huge collector back in... of uh, homebrews. <laughs> Mm -hmm. You got you went right for him. I was like, I'm gonna squish you, little <laughs> little dude, little flower monster. <laughs> um, Dana says he missed out on the Princess ah! Rescue, but he's got the Ram and the Harmony. I'm waiting for the 7800 flashcard. Oh, well, they, <laughs> I guess they're just endlessly coming from there. Yeah, you keep talking. I, I'll keep going. I'll take the. Are they even working on a 7800 card? I don't know. Yeah, I don't have a 7800 card either. That would be really nice to have, especially with, um, what's the chip called? Damn. If it had a chip or the emulation of a chip inside oh. of it. I can go backwards a little bit. Can't do that in the original game. Really? Yeah, you can only go forwards in the original game. Oh. Uh, James, change the artwork. Thank you. There's, should have told me. Yeah, That's your I job. failed. That's your job. Yeah, I'm the one who failed that. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much, Arena Foot. I, I just completely forget each time. So I just change it over and go, Oh, next game. I got him. Yay! Okay, those those yellow things are things you can hit. They're coins or boxes. Yeah, I mean, but I hit them and they didn't go away. What? The yellow ones, right? Or maybe I did it wrong. Ah, I see. Okay. Yes. Thank you, Arena Foot. <laughs> Good job, he says. <laughs> it was tough, but I changed it. I changed that graphic. I mean, I do have to prepare these beforehand. Oh, obviously, this was... I, this looks like it's made in Batari Basic. Just because of the music is... A little bit off. <laughs> I don't know if Batari Basic has ability to do advanced music or just the built-in TIA terrible notes. But it's pretty close. C a couple notes are off though. Um, so yeah, this came with a nice box. Oh, I see. The There's a timer. I was like, Whoa, why would I not continue doing this forever? <laughs> just racking up the points. <laughs> it did not jump, apparently. No, but what was the beep, beep, beep? You ha hitting your head on the pipe, maybe? Or the low timer. Oh, low timer. Yeah, yeah. I was like, I, I had this stupid grin on my face. So I was like, well, I'm just going to do this until I get a high score. <laughs> oh, Arena Fudge yes, says yes, Batari Basic. Is it my turn? Yes. What? Well, Played twice. Well, uh, three the lives. times maybe. The lives. I thought it, you wouldn't have enough lives. Oh. I, I don't. I don't want to be petty or anything, but I. Uh, I had more points at this point, <laughs> at this level in the game. Oh, you didn't jump. <laughs> I believe that was I the comment you made either. about well, my pitiful skills. It's still a valid comment. <laughs> It's a valid comment. Oh my god. This is tragic. <laughs> tragic game plan. <laughs> well, these are just coins, so I can't get any... Oh, what? Are they random? I got that coin last time, and it was not a big Mario. 
Destruction, destruction. Oh, now I can't get under there. At least I have... well... I guess you're supposed to get up to it and then jump over it. Because obviously that thing kills you. Immediately. Can't go down that pipe. What is happening? Maybe you have to be right in the center. Okay, there we go. <laughs> Are they making fun of us? Oh, he's making fun of me for not moving. <laughs> <laughs> just racking up the points yep. while you wait to die. Ah, there we go. Oh, two buttons. So the C button ah. fires the fireballs. Oh, duh. Well, I just play at the beginning part of the game. So I don't, I'll never get that fireball. <laughs> no, I think you will. Okay. Yeah. Oh, he turned into a Goomba. Oh my god. Can I get up there? Ah, I can't get up there. Is that a fireball? Nope. Oh god. Oh, there we go. I mean, this is pretty much... Like, you could do a little bit better with the graphics of the ground and stuff and do some alternating... Um, brick patterns. And oh not yeah, just no, it's, solid. it's 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 pretty good. I'm the surprised. characters are good. I think the uh, main problem from like Nintendo's perspective is copying everything except the name. Is that the music <laughs> is exactly the same? Yeah, and music is a copyrightable thing. Like very yeah, artwork is too, but music is like mm, they get pretty pretty anxious about the music. How did you Ooh, know that was going nice. to happen? I didn't. I was just, like, hitting things. It was smorching things. Ah! Star does not protect you from falling down pits. No. I get to play again? Oh, you got... You beat my score. World 1-1 one, one, done. So we have to... We have to get a couple worlds, <laughs> at least. That's the, It's bad. Yellow bar in the lower left-hand corner is the timer. Yes. So that one is cons. I swear I got it on my first round that yellow thing and it did absolutely nothing so let's read the instructions oh it says oh no bj is at it again bowser jr apparently but it's just called bj will he ever learn better yet will the princess it seems like you can usually mark on the calendar when this is going to happen oh you know what the reason we're falling in is you have to press like you fall off you can't jump from the edge oh. i was nowhere near falling off and i pressed the button Oh. And then I fall into the, the hole. So it's very sensitive. Like if your toe is over the line, you fall into the hole. See? Oh, the first one made you big. They're a bit random then. They're not constant. It's more like if you hit a yellow... Th you just got an extra life. Or what That's is that? That's a coin. But a That's, coin just appeared on I the right-hand side. I ha you had that too. It's like it's your third life. coin. Oh. Oh, you can do that. Okay. Uh, yet again, BJ and his minions have managed to steal away the King uh -oh. Kingdom's most beloved princess, and it's up for you, up to you to rescue her again. It never uh. fails. As par for the course, BJ will be sending out his followers to stop you from completing your task. But they can be defeated. The kingdom is filled with lots of magical stones that contain power or items that you can use along your way to help rescue the princess. Why BJ hasn't got rid of them now is anyone's guess. So venture out once again, restore order to the kingdom. Here's the screen. Continue talking about the game. Will it be the first coin? Will it be the second coin? Will it be neither? That is makes this me the, big. Is this what I'm supposed to start reading on? Yes. Oh, I finished okay. the last page. Oh my god. Shown in the diagram below are the controls for the game. A <laughs> uh, uh, little bit back. A little bit back. Yeah, that kind of works. <clears throat> it's small on their screen, but it works. You may use an Atari or a Sega Genesis controller. When using a Sega Genesis controller, it must be plugged in before powering on the game, or else it won't be detected as one, and the controls will map out as an Atari joystick. No, to the Sega. It seems that not all Sega Genesis controllers are created equal. <laughs> it appears that most, if not all, three-button types work fine, but there have been issues uh -huh. with some six-button versions that don't work correctly. Holding oh. down on the mode button on power-up on power on may help but if okay. your controller doesn't work or map out the way it should then it is incompatible with this game and or atari vcs <laughs> so suck it so suck it Yay. 
Yay, fireball. How to start playing. When you turn the power on, you'll notice that the main character will be running around the castle. This is the title screen. Press your action button or B button on the Genesis controller to start playing. You will then see the level and life display screen. Once it shows, it takes a few seconds to load up the level. Once it does, you can press your action button to start playing. This screen shows after you lose a life or finish a level. You can also use this screen as a pause in case you need to go to the bathroom. <laughs> what key? What key does that? Um, Black and white? No. It's just that after you die, it, you can oh, okay. stay in there at the pause. Oh, okay. Having the fireball is really, really See, every time really you get helpful. a coin, it increases that bar. <laughs> well, that was one that a coin came out of it. I wonder if this does what height. Maybe not. But it doesn't do it every coin. Uh, I we'll think it's out. just that, like, the resolution is not... Oh, yeah. It's like it takes, like, three coins That's before it goes up or something. That's like true, that. because in the original game, it has a coin counter, mm -hmm. like, per coin. But there's not enough room yeah. on the screen to do that. Why is this flashy? That's really weird that they didn't have enough... I mean, it's in Batari Basic, so the tools you have, they're not... Because there's enough resolution to do that with sprites that you already have. But it's Batari Basic, so... I will forgive them. They weren't doing it in assembly. Eh. You can't move too fast, because... You'll just run into guys, I find. You have to, like, kind of slowly... Can I kill this? Yes. I don't know if you killed it. Damn it! Or if it disappeared. Did they ever disappear? They do, actually. Maybe it, it might have disappeared. disappeared. It came over! Ah, I didn't make it any further. Like, you exactly go ahead. the same. You go ahead. Yeah? Okay. The entire kingdom consists of 16 horizontally scrolling levels. You may run left to right and right to left on all solid platforms, and the screen will scroll along with you until it reaches the beginning or the end of the portion of the level. Um, and if you pass by any of these coins, yes, uh, but and then you scroll back, they'll be gone. Because oh, when I first it does uh, keep track. When of I first tried it, that'd be a very I didn't grab cheating. any. No, what I mean is that they disappear oh, if completely? you hadn't grabbed them. Yeah, because oh, when wow. I first tried it, I you have to hit the coins from underneath. You can't hit them from the side. And I okay. thought they were coins, but when I hit them, um, they didn't. Oh, nice. So there are hidden all things. Or if that'll continue. Nope. <laughs> yeah, I've hit them from underneath. Well, you have to hit them from underneath. I didn't realize that. I thought that they weren't coins. And oh. then you were like, why are you hitting the coins? Just like power up, like just collect them, touch them. Y that yeah. makes sense. I thought that you could hit them from the side. But yeah. Nope. That's the same in the Mario's. Whoa, Once you reach the end of the first half of one level, you must travel down the last pipe, unless on the X3 levels. Okay. Doing this will warp you to the beginning of the second half of the level so you can finish it. This will also right. act as your checkpoint. Okay. If you lose a life, you will start back at the second half of the level instead of the beginning. On levels such as 1 to 3, you will need to jump on a trampoline that will only appear once all the enemies on the screen have been defeated. Oh, to finish a level, you will need to jump or run into the flagpole at the end. The higher you jump on the pole, the more bonus points you will receive. Oh, okay, so the times count. four bonus will not have a flagpole, as you will instead come face to face with BJ. I don't. I, BJ means something else. You know that, right? Bowser Jr. <laughs> now let's talk about what you find. In these oh, the people. other meaning. The, the meaning. Filth. I. Did not label it thus. God, exact same spot. We got more points. <laughs> yeah. I don't care oh, about... points don't matter now. This Difficulty game. has nothing to do with points. On this game, I don't care As about... I've been arguing. <laughs> In this game, I don't care about the points. Except for getting extra it's lives. Some, it's objective. It doesn't matter what you think or care about <laughs> in the moment. <laughs> in the moment. Get out of here, never-ending Goombas. They are never-ending, but they're also never stopping of the points giving. True. Oh, I can't get down there. Oh my god, it's like... Shoot him! Shoot that turtle in his face. <laughs> okay. Oh. No, don't jump down the hole! Terrible. 
I am gonna play now for a short time. Points, lives no. matter. What's that? <laughs> Somebody says points, lives matter. They think points matter. And a little light, a little guy with a ice cream cone head. Somebody keeping track of my score? 17.70.77. Power bricks, what did you get to on here? Power bricks, you can patch these at any time. What? From below. That does, that does. <laughs> Waterworks pipes, you'll find at the end of the half level, go to warp to the second. Oh, you did trampolines. You did. Are you moving back on pages? No. Okay, special items. There's the silver coin, 400 points, cosmic power, 1,000, 1-up veggie, 1,000. Very rare. We haven't seen that day yet. Gives you an extra life. Flagpole, X points. We don't know. Touch is at the end of the level. Magic platform, which we have not seen yet. Uh, moving platform helps you get where you want to go, but once you touch it, it'll stop moving and become a set of bricks. Or a platform in the X3 levels. I'll just... Oh, oh, Jesus! It's it's hard judging. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Distances. Like you can't you can be on the ledge and not falling off yet, but there's this area at the end where you can't jump. Yeah, oh, you can't jump. You can't jump from there. You haven't fallen yet. <laughs> but you can't. But when jump. you press the button, you do not jump, despite the fact that you're still on the ledge. I right. suspect if you stopped moving, I'll test you it. probably could jump up, but you can't run and jump. Oh. Well, at least you got that back. You'll find another one. <laughs> uh, enemies. Fungi. These are the weakest of the BJ's minions. Pokey. The turtle comes in red or green. Green ones will walk wherever they want. Oh, the red you know ones what? will have you more can of a jump brain. Off there. And not fall from platforms. Oh. I'm going to try it on... Oh. Pokey shell. Once they've retreated back into their shell, you can kick it by running into it. Uh, whichever direction they go, facing, will, oh, there you go, you can kick it. And you kicked it into yourself. <laughs> Not. Okay. Yay! Once they go, you can't stop them. Oh, okay. So that's different than in the original? You can hop on a shell, Super Mario Brothers. Pretty sure you can. Flying pokies, which we haven't seen yet. Cause oh, it's, cause Trace, that was a fight! Because we suck. Uh, flying pokies, that's what I just did. Flying pokies. Bailey, this beetle is like pokey, except fireballs can't hurt it. Ah! Oh, no. Prickles, this prickly beast can't be jumped on because of the spikes on his back. They can be done away with... They can be done away with a fireball, though. Prickles ah. ball. Ooh, nice. Most of the time, Prickles arrives by falling out of the sky, all balled up. Watch out for him. Once he lands, he spreads out and becomes Prickles. <laughs> Prickles. Audrey 3. Feed me! Sometimes they can be found in the pipes, so beware. You can only get rid of them by shooting them. Ah. Yeah. Gunner! This son of a gun will come flying in to hurt you. You can jump on him, but you can't shoot him. Stomp! Just avoid him. He can't be bothered or defeated. He's all fine and dandy until you come near. Kid Stomp. Here's Stomp's kid. He's always bound with his friend brother. <laughs> They're just as stubborn as their pa, so avoid them as well. Fireball. You will only see these in the castle. Can't be defeated, so just avoid them. Beating the game and, and the second quest. Once you've defeated BJ for the first time... He doesn't have the energy to run away. Finally, this gives you the opportunity to save the princess in the next room. She'll be there waiting and be so ever thankful for saving her. Uh, at this point, you can be happy to have beaten the game, or you can go on the second quest. Yep, the princess does what she does best and gets captured again. Oh. You'll start over at 1-1, but this time BJ puts it in hard mode. <laughs> Finally, he realizes that the fungi are worthless and replaces them all with Baileys. Oh, okay. Some of the green pokies will be replaced by red ones, too. This time he manages to find a fast fast to find faster minions and they'll move twice as fast. Specifically they are twice as fast. Specifically. Specifically. 
It's not that they're faster and twice as fast as Hooray. the fast. Never mind. What? The magic platforms don't want to be as helpful either and will be half go? the size. I don't. I wasn't watching. I'm reading. I just fell off the edge. Now I'm not big or fireball -y. I need my fireball. Game over. When you lose all your lives, your game will end, so you'll see the game over screen along with the sad tune. <laughs> but don't let that damper your spirits as you can continue your quest at the beginning of the world that you left that you left on. You can also select other defeated levels by pressing up and down. Once you find the level that you want to start off on, press the action button and try again. I guess this is a pipe? Yes, okay. I was I just like jumped and died off of that. Yay! Oh, okay. There we go. And then it turns into... Okay. Whoa, that was wow. close. Other options. The game can be reset almost any time by pressing down the reset switch on your 2600. Sorry, Atari 2600. If the game is being due too difficult for you, you can start with five lives instead of three by putting the player one difficulty switch into A mode. Like detecting the Genesis controller, you can only do this if the switch has been flipped. Wait, we're on B mode. On. Are we in the hard mode? You get three lives, so that therefore we're in hard mode. Hard mode. Oh, what is what is easy, easy mode? mode? Is five lives. Oh, okay, that makes. I mean, we should be in this mode. You shouldn't have five lives. Five's too many. <laughs> He's said. not suggesting that five <laughs> is too many. He is telling you, five, five is too, too many. many. There's no game, good games with five lives where you start out. The three is the normal number. I made it further that time. We played some games that had five lives, and we were happy, happy, <laughs> happy. to have them. <laughs> yes. Don't take any of this ranting, like, at face value. It's all, <laughs> it's all subjective. Oh, I was going to turn on the fan because it's getting toasty. It is. There I'm toasty. Is that better? Much better. Program graphics, manual, and artwork by Chris Spry. Lawsuits by Nintendo. <laughs> Original game music scored by Koji Kondo, so he does a tribute, the uh, music. Arranged for the Atari 2600 by Chris Spry. Special thanks, Fred Quimby, Random Terrain, Rev Eng, Tinker Nut, Joseph Karam, and Albert no. and Atari Age for taking so the risk. Oh, did you become small? Game testers, Stardust Forever, uh, Liduario, Kevin Moss 3, Crime Fighter, uh, Ice Endless! Endless, endless mushrooms! Ais Posta, who is a regular watcher of the show. And Yerky, thanks to Atari Age Community for showing a lot of interest in this project and all of your feedback and suggestions. Um, so it is very unfortunate that this was pulled off the market by Nintendo. They would never, they would never approve of this in a million years. No. Because why would, why would they bother making a couple dollars even if they were gonna get paid? For this, they have no. Yeah. No! Oh, did you try and jump? <laughs> There's a little Atari logo on it, supposedly. Uh -huh. It's not very many pixels, but. Yeah, it's pretty good. It's I buy it. Enough. I believe little, it. Little mountain, Fuji Mountain. I made it all the way through to the end of that level without dying. As as though I were some sort of gamer. You're getting. Better. Which I am, just I'm not an Atari gamer. <laughs> but these are... I hadn't been, now I am. Yeah, you're forced into it. Oh, this is fun. <laughs> you need to find the biggins. The thing that makes you big, that gives you extra life, unless you fall down a pit, which is what, the way I die most of the time. So unfortunately, this will be the last broadcast for a little bit. We're going on a little hiatus. Oh, you found the one up. Oh my God, you have four lives now. It's too bad you don't get a multiplier for the amount of lives you have. That's right. Like in as visitors tech challenge. And I, if anybody needs extra lives, it's me. <laughs> I don't know, you're doing pretty damn good. Oh, I oh. should have said that. Now Sabotage. comes the test. He does disappear. Whoa, he almost like bounced off the wall there. A Did. little bit. Totally like, bounced. Eh, 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 and you jumped back. 
So you can smash this because it's gold yes. colored. Yes, it's a row of coins, right? Uh, yeah. Because you can walk we'll, on it, though. It's also, not... look. Yes. Oh, you have. You good. can walk on the coins too. Remember so in the. Not coins it's things that push out coins but it automatically just gives you the coin. that's kind of i think where they're going with that Ooh. and the star yay you're just finding all the stuff uh, oh. Oh. no you're fully loaded no it's very now you're down to mini mario it's a Mario. <laughs> Mario. Oh, no. Wow, that's a very lucky row of coins uh, or you power ups. Actually, they you power -ups. you usually were at that point. At, when I was getting stuff out of the box. When you start that part of the level, oh. you were almost always with fireballs. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. But it gave you everything within those. Blocks. Okay. Oh, where's the dude? It's weird. No, you can't hop up there. No. In the original game, you can. No! No, no, no. No, no! No! <laughs> you have to stand on the green and hop. You can't hop from the All top right. top. I've tried and died and failed. Wow, they really like loading you up there. Oh, uh, one more. Oh, yeah, he got it again. Maybe it's just like the odds are so good with that many power up spots. <clears throat> so, this programmer also took the risk and he did. Uh, mushrooms are always there. I'll have to remember that. They're not always there, though. He did a Sonic the Hedgehog game as well but uh, they're not as litigious Sega so it's still in the store and I'll be ordering that how do you get over there very soon I, oh uh, you know what oh you'd fall off that ledge just just fall off and fall down very carefully there you go or do that ah! <laughs> or do that too <laughs> Luckily, I have more lives. <laughs> those fives are terrible. Look at those, that font. It's oh, an it exact like upside down two. No, they're terrible font. As, uh, you heard it here first. Terrible that font. That is a terrible font. It's terrible. <laughs> <laughs> Let there be no question that that is a terrible font. Everybody knows. So who in the chat knows what my t-shirt is? What is this about? What is this in reference to this geeky shirt? I mean, it's an easy question if you know it. It's not like super crazy trivia, but let's see if anybody out there knows it. It's a really good version. It's much harder than the original, that's for sure. But it is a very good version of Mario. Super no! Good. Why do I suck so out of jumping? <laughs> Lack of practice, that's why. But still almost 30,000 points. That's pretty good, it's right? An excellent game of Super Mario Bros. It is. For 2600. Yeah. Right? Princess Rescue. Princess Fact. Rescue, that's right. Yes. Even though not a lot of Princess Rescue has <laughs> happened. We haven't even seen her. Thus far. Let a lot of rescuer. Pseudo Mario has happened. <laughs> Woohoo! Lots of power ups now. It is much better. Oh! That was a coin coin. A real it, coin, yeah. It looked like one anyways. I don't know if it was. It was some sort of power up. Maybe it was the yeah. mushroom. Maybe you got the pow the uh, one up. No. No, it added to the coin. It's oh, like a okay. multi-coin, I think, maybe. Oh, and your levels that you smashed seem to return when you go off screen. Oh, like the basic ones? Mm-hmm. Oh, okay. But not the yellow ones. They disappear forever. Yeah, they disappear when you leave the screen, if you didn't get them, I think. So you can stand on them there. Yeah. They're like mystery boxes. That's what they are. With the question marks. That's what yeah. in the original game they were. Ah. <laughs> that's what I thought. <laughs> <laughs> that's exactly what I thought. I was like, ah! 
Yay! There you go. That isn't even the one that you were getting, right? Nope. This is on the first level. But I must go faster. There we go. Is it time to do squats? <laughs> Four lives. Now I have to find that mushroom that you found. And does it return every time you start a level? Does what? The mushroom? That mushroom. Uh, no, because I hit all those blocks every time. And it didn't come back. And didn't get it every time, but I did get it twice. Okay, and it's here, right? Uh, it's... I when it's I here. found it, I found it in there, yeah. Okay. Oh. It's so instead it's of the star. A, yeah. Ah. That part is jumping the, is so hard in this game. Yeah, I don't know what it is. Something that about makes it. it hard. Like it looks the same as as the original game. Like the jumping seems normal, but it's some for some reason it's slippery or you, maybe you fall off ledges easier. Where's my big nothing? When you were playing, you were getting like crazy bonuses. Yes, there. spend your time feeling jealous about it. Why don't you? <laughs> that's excellent use of time. Do 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 do. I knew it. That's so stupid. <laughs> Give me there stuff. You no know, muffin. No wonder you did so well. It was nice to you. And I get a, I get a coin. Hey! That coin I didn't get that coin. How come he got a coin? You got a one up. I want a one up. I only got it. Twice. Ooh, whoa, I survived that? Yeah, I know. <laughs> it's crazy. Okay. Jumping. The hardest part of this game. Jump. Oh, it, did, it didn't turn into coins like it did before. It was uh, green no. before. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay, I want some things. There, that's what I want. I hear you, Cap. There's some plaintive scratching of the door. You can open up the door if you like. But then the cats will come in. I did it! Oh! You got more points, though. Who's that? Oh! Hi, I'm here. Hi, cats. Hi, buddy. Oh! I'm just gonna leave the door open because the most dangerous thing in the house just came in the room. <laughs> <laughs> After this, we'll move on, because we both did very well. Yeah. I mean, I had a better score than you did. You did? Would you say that um, I was on hard mode then? <laughs> because I got a higher score and not getting further? Oh. Whoa. Uh, what? <laughs> well, oh, I, got, I, I got further in score. Forget levels. Levels don't matter. It's only score. Only score. In this, it's levels. In all <laughs> games, it's levels. That's my point. No. I'm being objective. You are not. <laughs> you're not being objective. Oh, look at this. It's not. You're not being objective at all. It's. it's and you're. It's you both. just. No, it's not both. It's not just whatever makes you happy. Oh, just, the complaining. Oh, I know. There's. This is not the love I signed up for. <laughs> I wanted this special is... love. That's Atari. If you haven't seen them before. Oh, this looks like dungeon. Oh, Whoa, the He's fireballs! What is that leg doing? Look at this jump. Oh, there you go. These jumps. These are always the jumps that kill you. Where you have no room, mm -hmm. your head hits the ceiling, and you immediately fall down after you hit it. Yeah. They never kill me. I didn't even get to jump. They never kill me. Because <laughs> you don't make them? I never make it to this, this, <laughs> that sort of challenge level well smaller. beyond. This will actually help. Yeah. Yay, there you see? go. Oh, nice. The blocks. Whoa, that was fast. Oh, I'll turtle. I don't have fire. Well, it's good it went that way. Yeah, I was just going to say, look out. I wasn't thinking about that. Should I go... No, I'm going to jump from here. Look out for the ying. Oh, cool. Oh. Oh. <laughs> and I fell. Mm, it's okay. You can do this. There you go. Woohoo! It ain't nothing. Yes! Oh, uh -oh. this is... I have no weapons. Boss. Uh, boss mode. Oh, that's a pretty good looking boss. Watch out for this cat here. He's going to... Is he going to help you? No. 
<laughs> the answer is the answer is no. No, answer is no. <laughs> oh good. Okay. Now I have to jump on him. On top of him? Yeah. Hit him oh. on the head. While avoiding if he's throwing things. Oh. Maybe while he's in that mode. Nope. While well, he's not in that mode. Hmm. So I did pretty good, made it pretty far, not yeah. too bad. You made it to the end of one of one. Oh, well, yeah. <laughs> no. One of, no. Made it to the end of level one. That was the end of level one. It'd be one four. This is starting Why over. Why does it say one one? I don't know. That doesn't make any sense. Yeah, it, yeah, it would because be it, one. I just yeah, press yeah, a button okay. and it starts. Yeah. So, let's go to the third game. Hey, little monster. What are you doing, mister? Which is, is I'm going to switch it now, because I remembered Super Portal 6. Oh, this is going to be exciting. Super 3D Portal 6. I mean, I oh. hope it's exciting. Actually, it's a two-joystick game. Where's my other joystick? Are you gonna Please play? hold. Oh, there it is. It's not that far. That's a mess. It is a mess. A nest. <laughs> Hold that for a second, oh. please. Do I have to press a button? No. The button is on the other joystick. Uh, so if you can press the B. I'm pressing it. And let it go. Okay. Super Portal 6. So it's Super 3D it's Portal portals 6. and two player. That's good. Yes. Well, it's not two player, but it requires two joysticks. Oh. So I thought we would play cooperative mode. <laughs> sure. So, oh, there's the music. Kind of. It's kind of repeating. Um, so that was Super Portals, uh, Super 3D Portal 6 by Hinchy, made in 2008. Um, Super Port, we will have to read the instructions for this. But not until we try it. Okay. Remember that time with Aztec Challenge and you were like, this is a game is super hard. You need to know how to do it. And then I didn't need to know. You might be, <laughs> you might still be right. But. So I move uh -huh. and you point. Oh. So point up. Oh, keep pointing there. Okay, good. And. Oh, and you. Okay. Put the second one. There we go. Okay, you totally control just about everything. And put one near us. Oop. No, I think we can still do it. Yep, yeah, okay. Can I jump? Yep. Oop. Oop. Okay, there you go. Kay. Don't want to go through that. Oh God, I killed the game. <laughs> <laughs> I, I portaled out. Oh, I think we can fix it. Okay. Uh oh, not anymore. Let me get over here again. Come down, come down from there. This one is just trouble. Okay, you're going out again. How did we portal bye out? Bye. I don't get it. Bye bye. And we just made it past the wall barely somehow. Okay, where am I? Nope. Uh, not that switch. Now let's try and get back in. There. Oh no, because yet. Yeah. Am I back? Oh, oh, we warped into a different room. <laughs> we we wall hacked into a different room. <laughs> Oops. Uh, just sec, just sec, just sec. Oh, perfect. Oh no, that's inside a wall. Oh, I can't go any. Oh, oh, I can kind of. There we go. I'm back. Okay. okay. That's good. Okay. A point somewhere down. I can... Oh, just sec. I'll go. There we go. Yay! I don't know what level we're on, though. Okay. Oh, no, not quite. Oh. No. 
Okay. Oh, there. Shoot. Now go in. Okay. okay. Now, just hold on. Now back. A little further back. Uh, I think I'm going to fall. Uh, okay. So then we did it wrong. Go down. Down all the way to the beginning. And go underneath that ledge a bit. Okay, now fire yours. Okay, try it there. No. Okay. Um, uh, must be somewhere here I can do it. There you go. There you go. Now okay. make a blue one. Okay. Now let's make a blue one up there somewhere. And point so I can make mine anywhere. No. Um, uh, let's just do it that we'll way. Like yeah. That. Yeah. Okay. No. <laughs> you moved the blue one, and now we're off the screen. <laughs> Where am I? Okay. Don't don't press your button. Okay. I'm trying to warp back into the blue. Oh, it's just it's just, it's just oh, you're good now. Okay, I'm good. <laughs> Go through now. We're 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 oh. hacking it now because that's where. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah. Make a blue one at the top, and then I'll just fall. Just a sec. That works. A sec. Stop. Stop it. Okay. Do blue now. Up. Straight up. There we go. There we go. Now, hold on. Now go in. Oh, okay. That worked. Um, point uh, down? Yeah. Oh. Uh oh. No. 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 Stop <laughs> it! <laughs> no, go back. Uh, no. Okay. Just a sec. Point uh, down? Point down. Jump. Can you jump? Oh, I can oh, jump. Okay. okay. I forgot it. I can jump. Okay. Now go back. Uh, All right. Try blue up there. Yeah. And then I'll just go this way. Oh, okay. Just right. Not enough. Uh, little... There. There we go. There you go. Okay. Stop. Stop. Go through. It'll be up and, top. Yep. Oh. You go through and like get. <laughs> I kill you. There we okay. go. I have to and hold no, it or I'll fall. Just... Oh, oh, you did it. No, that's yeah. I did that because that was what I was trying to do. It just didn't work. Okay. You want the blue one there again? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> It's not quite enough room to to get out of the way of the blue. Um, um, just a sec here, just a sec. Okay, go back up and get caught up there again. Okay. But don't, oh, like, don't fit be... between them. Okay, I'll Don't try. jump, just, like, there. stay there. Okay, now I'm going to try blue. to shoot the blue over. Yes. Did... Oh, why did not work? Nobody knows. That's weird. Okay. Move over. Okay, here's what we do. Yeah. Um... Move over and shoot it up there. Okay. Okay, now. Go through, and when you get through, press your red. Oh, okay. No, it didn't work. No. I can still do it. Just let me uh, keep trying. Yeah, no, I, I think you're getting it about as high as, as possible. <clears throat> well, you did get it higher that time, <laughs> but I'm thinking I have to do it way before. Oh, I know. <clears throat> no, I don't think it's possible. Yeah, no, I don't think so. Because I'm doing it immediately after I go through. Oh, here, 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 just well, that's a sec, not bad. just a sec. Now try it. Oh, oh yes. Oh no, I have to do it while I'm falling. I think I can do it now, if I time it just right. Yeah, you can get it. There yeah! we go! Blue, please. Just, there we go. Yay! I don't know if that's how you're supposed to do it. Is this game Super 3D Portal 6 from 2008? It sure is, it sure is. but... <laughs> <laughs> that sounds like something from an infomercial or something. Because <laughs> it's so laboriously spelled out. <laughs> yeah, why, well, yes, it is Super 3D Portal 6 from 2008. <laughs> so we played it enough. Let's read the instructions. 
Uh, Super 3D Portal 6 is a bootleg demake of Portal for the Atari 2600. Unlike some demakes, this is actually programmed for play on in a real Atari 2600 or emulator. Because sometimes they make them for Windows, uh, just chunky graphics. Right, right. But they don't actually run on a 2600. Uh, make it completely accurate to the system specs. Features two portal gameplay, aiming feature, jumping and platforming, intentional glitches. Yeah, right. <laughs> What no. does that mean? Everything that goes wrong in the game, I planned it. Oh, yeah, but for then, sure. But why would you say intentional glitches? It's only a glitch if it's not intentional. Therefore, that's true. It's part of gameplay. That's right. So it's is it glitchy or is it not glitchy? Make up glitchy your mind. Glitchy is bad. Uh, 2D is one of the features. Oh. And that's, despite the name. Yes. It's not super 3D. <laughs> I, I'm guessing is a little tongue-in-cheek, all of this. <laughs> Uh, controls. Super 3D Portals uses a unique two-joystick control scheme to be more faithful to the original Portal, while still conserving the Atari's limitation. limitations. You could do it on one double button, yeah, because the button pressing to... down mm -hmm. doesn't do anything, and that could be the rotate. Mm -hmm. And the second button could be the, um, the second Portal. First button, first Portal. Second button, second Portal. Because up is jump. So somebody needs, the guy needs to remake this for a two button controller, Genesis controller, and that would be amazing. But it's actually kind of fun with two players. Mm -hmm. um, so joystick one, left, right, move left, right. Joystick uh, one up is jump. Joystick two, left, right is aim. Counterclockwise, clockwise. Joystick one, two is fire, fire the red or blue portals. And that is it. So we figured it out. Yep. So I can jump up these. Mm -hmm. Oh, I fall them. I fall down though. If I let go, okay. that's kind of funny. You're, you, the you only stay on the ledge. If, yeah. So turn around, any direction. There we go. Yeah, this should be no problem. And uh, sure. Let's make yours <laughs> the one that is the one that goes to all the time. Mm -hmm. And I'll be mine is the one that comes from. Uh, let's, yeah, let's make it up there. And then I can fall over. Mm -hmm. Turn it, please. I'll do that again. Uh, that's just down. Okay. Same pattern. And then the same pattern again. ZWH. Okay, that's right now. Pushing against the side. Maybe not. Oh, God. <laughs> this sec. Do yours now. Shoot yours against the wall. Okay. There we go. You're in anyways. Okay. Okay. Um, get rid of yours. Uh, ooh. Over to the right. Just point it up over there so I can move. Oh, why am I... Here, I'll, just hold on. Here there we go. we go. Okay. I'm going to jump up here. We'll do a diagonal. Why can I... Oh, oh, this might work. There we go. Oh. It is kind of like weird and rough, the game. It's like you can kind of go through things and it's super weird and glitchy, but it works that way <laughs> that was the totally <laughs> no portals needed uh, nope. method non-portal level uh do it yeah yeah oh uh now i'm in portal hell okay we knows uh right left up down oh no the game is frozen the screen is frozen. oh what is happening that's, that's weird. That's a, that's a few levels back, too. Yeah. Ten, nine that, levels dudes. back. Let's get this going again. Never happened before. There we go. But welcome to... <laughs> welcome <laughs> to level we're on where we're stuck. Hopefully it wasn't frozen. Oh, there you are. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. Um, there we no, go. that's mine. I just screwed it up. Oh. I, I buggered it. Now you're going to have to do it your way. 
you're you're dancing around and <laughs> flipping through. Uh... Oh, oh, we're almost. We're getting somewhere. We have to get in somehow a little bit. There. Oh. The angle of the arrow seems to matter. <gasps> there we go. Okay. Okay. Just a sec. I'll rotate, and I'm gonna. No. <laughs> You see my portal went off into oblivion. Yeah, it's at the top <laughs> of the screen. Oh, is it? Go and get in the blue one. Just a... Oh, no, no, no. Just a second. Okay. okay. You do yours. No, no. <laughs> Too late. Uh, we'll have to do yours next time. Try it. Yeah, I don't know if that'll make any difference, but maybe. Oh, jump there. Oh, what the? What the? <laughs> what? What the what? What? Uh, okay, I'm gonna do mine. It's not gonna work, but I'm gonna do it. No, we're both at the top of the screen now. So you're up there anyway. So now come down. That does help me find my spot. I haven't seen any of the game. Oh my god! Sorry, dude. Yeah, no, it was level one that it froze on. Oh, because it no. said the one at the bottom. That's why I was saying, yeah, nine. Only nine of the ten levels were uh, frozen. <laughs> oh my God! Sorry, they're all kind of samey, samey, samey. <laughs> and I think we restarted. We only have ten points. No, that's level ten. Oh, level ten. You get one point per level. <laughs> one point per level. <laughs> <laughs> and they expect to have a million levels, or at least nine hundred ninety-nine thousand nine hundred. I thought you could only do 99. Never mind. It depends how you store it. I think we're really fairly screwed. I think we're hooped in the hoop hole. Does this reset the level? No. Okay. We get to see all the levels. Oh, back a bit. There we go. Oh, back further. Uh, yay! Yay! No, there we go. Yeah. Starting at one again, because we don't want you guys to miss out. Over there the is way. a possibility oh, that... No, there you go. There. Is a pos... That should be good enough. It's a possibility that this glitchy, glitchy, glitchy game made it made the screen freeze. <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, go down. Go the other way. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. No, still good. We're still good. Okay. That's good enough. Uh, let's do it to the right. Oh, by the way. So I. Yeah. Oh no! What have oh. I done? <laughs> okay. Back I do up. that a lot. I do that a lot. I'm not very cooperative, as, as people go. As <laughs> as, as humans are. As humans are, you're the least I'm cooperative. Poorly, human. I I rate poorly in cooperation. <laughs> Okay. No, over the... Oh, you want to do that. Yeah, that should work. If I keep pressing. No, it's not quite okay. enough. Oh, this one. I think it's back here. Okay, try again. There we there go. There we go. Yep, we're still good. Good. Here, go up there. And make mine there. No, other no, side. No, this isn't going to work. Yeah, yeah, it'll work. I think it'll work. Go to the right. No, oh, not you. Hold on. Oh God! What have you done? That's how it. That's Push how down. it happens. Push down. Get onto that orange thing. Don't press your button. Just find no. it and hump it. <laughs> I'm trying. <laughs> I think I'm stuck. But don't you press your button. I'm not. Because we can get out. If I can shoot against something. Yeah. Shoot against that one. Turn. Oh, just act. Just let me turn. Don't. Let me just, stop. Oh, what are you okay. doing? There. Okay. Can you shoot your button now? Oh, it doesn't stick to anything? Is that it? Yeah, that's uh, one of the issues. But if I can get out of here... So oh, there it is! <laughs> it's too high! Turn to the right. There. I can't... Oh! Oh, I got there for a second. Okay, oh, oh. Ho, ho, ho! Ho! Go down and touch yours and then, like, stop wriggling around. <laughs> What's the object? The object of the game oh, is... Oh, shoot your button. Oh. Yes. Now stop, stop. Now... Okay, turn so we can at least get ours on the board. Mine on the board. Okay, just, just go forward a bit. No. There, now turn yours and shoot yours. I just got to get mine on the board. Okay, now okay. push against the wall. Okay. 
This is not going to work, but... Okay, to the right. Yes. Now you go. There we go. And, oh, we did it. Cooperation! <laughs> so we found out what the problem is. Sort of. What puts you outside the board. It's but not always. Sometimes other things put us outside. The first yeah, time we, we were fully inside and it was a thin border and it, like, <laughs> jiggled us out. Irk the jerk says, found a bug. <laughs> <laughs> yeah there's a large bug in this game and i know how to solve it is just put the portals somewhere on the board to begin with okay ah uh yeah and then turn there we go yeah so the object of the game is to get to the dot by making little portals oh, oh there nope there. <laughs> there. <laughs> there. I think that's good enough. Let's try it. We'll go for it. Yay! Okay. Turn. Uh, don't. Don't do anything crazy. Oh, that's good enough. Whoa, whoa! Oh, Glitcher, okay. Glitcherama. Okay, you go at the top. Okay, left. Top. Oh, uh oh. That's okay. To the left. There we go. Oh, oh, you, you, you. oh yeah, you got it. <laughs> that's the and one. And this is the other one you can do without. Uh, slippery, but it, yeah. You I did can. it all the way. You did it. <laughs> already did it all the way. It's still working up there. Oh, good. Everybody's still seeing it. That's why they were so quiet. I was like, what's what's going on? Well, I would have and thought there would be more outrage. I would. Shouldn't I there have there been, been be more outrage? Yeah. Whoa, what the hell was that? Okay. okay, shoot yours over there. Yes. What is happening? Shoot it. It's like I'm instantly going into it. Okay, don't, yeah. Now yeah, put no, it here. Do it there. Yeah. yeah. There we okay, go. Okay, now, cool. Tom. <laughs> no! No! <laughs> it's not my fault. I wasn't even moving. You know what's going on? What? It's pushing me into the portal. Mm hmm Which instantly puts me back in my red portal. You see? What? Why? I don't know why what? it's happening. I know what Stop is it. happening. <laughs> okay, jump. I'm going to do it. Jump. Okay. Jump. There we go. Okay. Madness. Uh, oh, it worked. Yeah. Madness. Okay. <laughs> this game is super glitchy. <laughs> but it actually adds to it. As long as we don't go, go outside the borders anymore. Because that is terrible. Oh, no, no, it was fine. It was fine. It was good. Totally fine. Everything's good. Do Carol, okay, shoot <laughs> your portal on the ceiling. Do it. Might mean. Yeah, look, because it was out of bones. Oh, okay. It was just begging for us to be all screwing ourselves and <laughs> pooching is, the, the pooch hole. That is true. <laughs> Hooray! Oh, that's not bad. No, not good enough, though. Oh, I think it is. Uh oh. What are you doing? Okay. That's definitely good enough. Okay. Shoot, shoot, shoot you. Oh, phew. <laughs> yes so if you haven't noticed the bug is both portals start outside of the maze in a real actual location <laughs> they don't have a non it's not set to zero it's not to set to the portal's not there yeah yeah the portal is there yeah and it's in a terrible spot <laughs> it's in but that's only part of it you can because we have on a spot yeah. sort of like that we've warped outside and yeah, yeah, and it also is, you can touch your portal as you shoot it, at some times. No, put it on the other side, please. Try it, try it this way. Uh, just note that you, you appear <laughs> on that side of the portal. Oh, that could be it. If you're shooting against a wall, you could be put into the wall if you're coming out on the wrong side. Okay, this, yeah, this is the right way. <laughs> that was quick. Uh, let's go up there. Ooh, Ooh, nice. Very nice. 
Oh, this. Okay. This is where we're on level 15 now. Holy crap. Okay. Oh, is this where we got stuck before? No. No, we got we stopped on 10. <laughs> Maybe it's random. Oh, oh, wait, 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 wait. What should I do? Try that side. I'll just come out the wrong side. Okay. I have it listed on my list, but didn't have a link to the ROM, so it was listed as no ROM. Now I have found the ROM you have. <laughs> Arena Foot. If anybody didn't know Arena Foot, who's in the chat right now, okay. is the keeper. Shoot yours somewhere over there. Shoot it. Get it over the there? Okay. Over there. <laughs> okay. okay, now go into the corner. Okay. Well, that's not going to work. <laughs> um, I think we had the right idea. But just wrong. Maybe we needed a bit more room? Like that? Yeah, maybe. Let's try that. Arena Foot. Nope. I'm going to have to jump. Jump while doing it. Oh, no, no. This is what we did. Okay. Back up. We do a launch. We go a bit further back. Sorry. There. Yeah. Okay. So when you come out, you have to... Uh, we have to angle it like this, and then you are going to shoot. Oh, yes. That's right. That's what we... No, it's fine. You can keep me up at that angle. Because it goes through anyway. Almost. I got go. it. So now you now will have, have to, to do go it. here. Yeah. Breaking our rules. Yeah, just once. Just for victory. Just for it victory. It just goes to show that, like, <laughs> you have to not have good rules uh because just you just have to not have them yeah oh oh almost. that's right uh oh no 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 that works that's fine yeah uh yep that's good we've done this level I think there's limited levels, and they're random, because level 10 Maybe. was not level 10. Yeah. But uh, we'll keep doing till we see a new one. Yeah, we've seen this one. Yeah, yeah. Oh, uh, ZWH. Who's that? I don't know. That's, maybe that's the guy who made it? I only have his pseudonym. I couldn't find his real name. Hmm. Um, when this came out, he was... Uh, he got a lot of press for it, hmm. obviously, because it has a portal name. Try against that wall. <laughs> so whenever you make like something that has a name to it, you can get your name in the paper. But uh, yeah, it's uh, it's pretty cool. I wish there was a level maker for it. That would be good. Or like another ROM pack. Uh, let's do it on the right hand side here. Uh, there. And we'll go here to the left. Yeah, we've done all these. I think we've uh, hit hit the uh, yeah. hit, hit the maximum. <laughs> yeah, too easy now. <laughs> we just know that was very cool um it was pretty cool it needs a lot more levels like a ton a yeah. ton of levels and it would be it'd be awesome um so the guy i mean it came out in 2008 he's long abandoned it yeah, yeah. obviously it's 10 years ago yeah um that's why i've never seen this game uh didn't know the rom was available to know programmer's name is zach hinchy so there we go is there a w in there because it was a ZWH. Yeah, so I guess his middle name is W. William. Wil Wil Wilfred. William. Uh, Wilfred. Willie. Wil Wil <laughs> Wonka. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Woo! <laughs> of course, that was going to come up. Uh, <laughs> not it's not many W time. names. Uh, Wal Wal Walter. Walton? It's not a, that's a last name. What Walt is? Walton. You can call people whatever you want. But you don't hear you can call that him as whippersnapper. The first name. It's not much of a first name. <laughs> Zach call whippersnapper him Hinchy. And until you correct us, that's, <laughs> that's your name. That's right. <laughs> so, 
so that was good. Uh, the camera's a little chunky and slow. That's not too bad. Um, good, good uh, bunch of games today. So we played, what were they? We played Run, Run, Die. <laughs> AVCS a -A -A Tech Challenge. Yes, which is um, Aztec Challenge. Aztec but made Challenge for, originally. For the VCS. 2600. Yep. Um, which was I good. I received to say that other one was harder. <laughs> uh, the Princess Rescue? No, I meant VCS. Oh. <laughs> yep. Uh, yep, Princess Rescue. A otherwise known as... Super Mario Brothers. Ario Brothers. Pulled, Ario Brother. Pulled, pulled from the shelf. Uh, and Super 3D Portal 6. Excellent. Needs wait, more levels. Wait, um... When do we play Super 3D Portals 1 through 5? They, uh... I don't know. Why is it Portal 6? Those are on different platforms. They weren't for the Atari. <laughs> Those are on, like, Pong consoles and the channel I can, F. I can see your lying face. You have lying <laughs> face right now. Looking up to the left is, a, is I don't know. There was something about your face that was nonsense bullshit. I am saying nonsense bullshit words. That's what the your number face said to me. <laughs> uh, when number four came out on the Vectrex up there, mm -hmm. and number two came out on like a handheld, like this handheld type. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what else. Um, those are all uh, really good. Um, so not a stinker in the bunch. Um, I like them all. What did you think of them? Yeah, yeah, they were good. They were yeah. fun. Yeah. I really like the Aztec challenge requiring so little of me in terms of how many <laughs> up, buttons down, to press. That was up, good. Down, up, down. Especially uh, on that one just continuous level. Uh, and as for uh, Ario Brother, <laughs> um, it was I was exactly as useless at that game as I usually am at the that at its shameless ripoff <laughs> mario brothers yeah that's a terrible uh, port <laughs> for the nes they just try too hard on that that nes yeah i mean it, version. It's, the original with the low res 2600 graphics really uses your imagination and when they put all the graphics in when they have the nes it just spoils it I mean, it's too much. It's like turning something 3D and then it loses that yeah. 2D flavor. Yeah. Like when, uh, you know, Wolfenstein went 3D, when yeah. it used to be 2D, flat 2D. Did you ever play that one on the C64? In Wolfenstein, the Castle most recent Wolfenstein? one? In the most recent one, you there's this point in the game where you, like, go to sleep yes. on your cot, and yeah. then you're in this dreamland, and in the dreamland you're playing Wolfenstein, Castle Wolfenstein. Cast, like the 2D flat one? Yeah, Octong. and the only difference <laughs> is that <laughs> the guns you find on the ground look like the guns in the new version. <laughs> but other than that, it's like the 2D, it's the 2, 3D version. It's like the, yeah. Games for the next show, Arena Foot. And says. I did infinitely better at it than I'd ever, ever done playing it before. <laughs> yeah, I was, I die immediately. Because I dodged. Because I, I was like, oh, you move when they shoot at you. Uh, it was like new technology for me. <laughs> well, it was a long time ago. <laughs> Yeah. So uh, we have some options for the next show. Ah, garbage is falling. It is garbage. Uh, let's see, which ones haven't we played? Played all of those. I'm r literally running out of games now. So, so get to it, make some more. I'll let Darcy decide because it's in two weeks. All right. Um, there's a break. There's a week break. From Very these ones? Week. Uh, no, there's some more. There's some more. Then there's hol there's those Christmas ones, as well. I've played all the boxed games. Oh, there's Scramble as well. I I uh, flipped this cartridge over to see what the game uh, <laughs> looked like. That didn't work. Did we play Scramble or Super Cobra Arcade when we played it? Um, so Super both, Cobra. Super Cobra. Okay, so Scramble is part of that. So the options are Scramble. See the rules change. I no longer get to pick. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. You do. I already played this. Oh, oops. And Stella's it. Stocking, didn't we? No, we did not play oh, Stella's Stocking. Oh, that was in Stella's Stocking. The, yes. There was a bonus in that's it or right. something. Yeah. That's right. Boy so the options trouble. are Scramble, Stratagem Deluxe, Gingerbread Man. It's probably too shiny. Did we play this one? Alia Quest. No. Marble Craze. Toy Shop Trouble. Hail Cruiser. 
and KO Cruiser. So those are the options. So we'll make we'll so you, play. You get to pick one. Scramble and Marble no, Craze. one. You get to pick one. You already said Scramble. You said I was picking all the. See how these things. Have... <laughs> he does not trust me to pick good games. I guess. You get to pick one out of all of this these. one. Marble Craze. Yeah. Okay. So in two weeks, that's when we come back. All the people watching. Sorry, we have to have a break for the sun and summer for a little bit. I heard it was going to be all lightning and clouds. <laughs> Unfortunately, <laughs> I hope not, but we'll see. Um, is that an actual bug in there? No. That's like free with purchase. <laughs> so we'll be playing Marble Craze. Oh, well, yeah, they can see it. There you go. Yeah, here, I'll I do it good. I do it like this. Real good. Can you read it? Can you read it? <laughs> it's a little shaky. But, yeah. <laughs> and uh, some other maybe works in progress games. And if I can't find any decent ones, they're playable at this point. And are point. we doing this? Then we'll probably do this as well. But maybe that's after. But we'll see. But at least Marble Craze <laughs> for sure. So I'll put it up in the forums. Because I have like a forum post that I try and keep updated of what games are coming up. So mm -hmm. people know. Um, and yeah, so that'll be on... What day is that? June something June the so it's the 18th today so is that like June 1st 1st June 1st yeah and uh yeah so everybody out there there's still a show this Wednesday no there is no show this Wednesday this is the last show before the break so I hope you enjoyed it played some good games um but yeah this is this is the last show till the Friday in two weeks, June 1st. So tune in then, you can watch all the repeats. Or if you haven't watched last episode, it's a three hour. Or if you have watched it, watch, watch it, again. it again. Yes, because it's that good of us completing all of the levels but not me. of Draconian. Because obviously I would be no help us. in doing such a thing. <laughs> <laughs> no, you probably would have got good after a while. Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> Um, so check us out on Facebook and Instagram and Twitters and on the Atari Age forum. I have a post under Homebrew. I don't know if that's the right place. It's not under pro It shouldn't be under programming. Might need to be under 2600. But I plan on doing non-2600 games in the future because we will <laughs> run out. Um, and I do have an Intellivision uh, LTO Flash cartridge. Which will allow me. Oh. Here, you just. You don't know how to do go. it. Because it was on your face. My that's face. How you do the it. camera likes my face. So I have an LTO flash cartridge um, for the Intellivision, but I don't have my Intellivision upgraded for high output, so I may do that in the meantime. I get it upgraded and then we'll do that. And also ColecoVision games and Commodore 64 games yeah. as well. Because I do have Galencia, which is a homebrew game. But I, that's the only one I have, so... I'm sure it'll be really hard to find homebrew Commodore games. No. Really hard. I think we will have to look... 10, 20 seconds would it take you to find some... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because that's a, probably an easier programming environment. I don't know. It's probably second. Maybe third. Like, Atari 2600 is probably the biggest homebrew scene. Is it? Yes. Hmm? Which I is, thought Commodore would be very, very high on there. I guess it is very, very it's high. It's the biggest demo scene uh, is okay. Commodore 64 because of its uh, audio chip. High demo chip. ability. High demo ability because it's awesome music. Um, and pretty good graphics. Um, so it's really good for demos, but not as big for games, as far as I can tell. But it's, it's up there. So it's probably Atari 2600. Coleco is pretty big. And then maybe C64, and then maybe in television. Um, if you can correct me if I'm wrong, if I'm wrong. Oh, at Arena Foot uh, tortured himself and watched all three hours of us <laughs> playing Draconian. <laughs> and if you look on our Instagram, you can see a picture of Daryl Spice Jr.'s television, who created the game, watching us play <laughs> his game. 
which is funny. And he said, oh, I'll spread it over three nights. It's too much. It's too much for one night. And I think Arena Foot was watching the hockey game while we were playing it. He had it on in the background, which is, you know, appropriate for a three-hour marath marathon of Draconian. Because it's pretty much the same over and over and over again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just the ships are in different spots, and it gets a little harder. But thank you for tuning in to this episode um, of Zero Page Homebrew. And we will see you back on June 1st. Hopefully I'll have like a review done by then or before then of Arena Foot's Atari 2600 homebrew book that just came out a couple weeks ago. I do have it and I just need to put it all together, do a little write up and and uh, edit it and pretty much everything. Yeah. <laughs> all of all of the all reviewing of the parts. Things. You know, all of the things that make into a video. Yeah, I need to do all that. <laughs> so thanks for tuning in and we'll see you next week uh in two weeks sorry two weeks bye bye ciao um did you ever 